My name is Yuma. I'm 30 years old. I'm an employee of a small company. I've been with this company for 8 years now. Recently, I've been entrusted with big jobs, and I'm feeling a sense of fulfillment every day. But my private life is not so fulfilling. Ah, uh, I want a cute girlfriend. Hey, Yuma! What's with the gloomy face? Since it's about you, I bet you were thinking about wanting a girlfriend again. Minase. His name is Minase. He's my colleague, the same age as me. Minase is handsome but serious and uptight, and I'm often said to be easygoing. Our opposite personalities work together, and we get along pretty well. What about you? I heard. You're in charge of training another pretty girl, aren't you? Yes, a new girl has recently joined our department, and Minase was put in charge of training her. I still remember the first time I met her. Nice to meet you. My name is Kazuki. I am still unfamiliar with a lot of things, so I'd appreciate it if you could teach me. Please give me your best regards. The new girl's name is Kazuki. She joined our company after changing jobs. Kazuki's really cute. Not only her looks, but also her personality. For example... Oh, Kazuki, is that your lunch today? You're cute and can even cook for yourself. You're amazing. <laughs> That's not true, but I am pretty good at cooking. Her lunch was a colorful meal with a lot of steamed vegetables that looked healthy. That's a cute girly lunch. I prefer meat, so I respect girls who can cook vegetables into a delicious meal. I can cook pretty much anything. What kind of food do you two like? I'm curious to know what your favorite food is, Minase-san. Sorry, I'm busy right now. Can we talk about this later? What's wrong with you, Minase? Uh, Kazuki, don't bother with that guy. And on a different day... Oh, Yuma-san, here's a cookie if you like. What? Thanks, Kazuki. Are these homemade? <laughs> yes, I made a little too many. Wow. I can't believe you can make such high-quality and delicious-looking sweets. I thought they were from a store. Thank you very much. Oh, Minase-san, would you like some too? I worked hard on it. No, I... Hey, hey, Minase, don't refuse. Just because you're good-looking and have a lot to choose from... Doesn't mean you should turn down an offer from a beautiful girl like Kazuki. Karma's gonna get you. Ah, uh, well then, I'll take it gratefully. Yes, I made it less sweet, just the way you like it, Minase-san. I hope it suits your taste. And so, Kazuki is cute, a good cook, and kind. She's the ideal woman. Naturally, there were a lot of guys who were after her. And of course, I'm one of them. And recently, I heard a rumor about her. To my surprise... Kazuki confessed her feelings to someone in the company. And in an even more unexpected turn of events, she was rejected. Who could this man be? I heard it was you. Is that true? Yeah. It was Minase who rejected Kazuki after she confessed her feelings. Y y you Why? There aren't many girls like that! You don't have a girlfriend right now! Why don't you go out with her? Why would you reject her? You're the one who likes her, right? Then this is your chance. Be happy. If you comfort her now, you might be able to go out with her. I don't do cowardly things like that! But seriously, you kept a distance from Kazuki from the very beginning, didn't you? Did she look like your ex-girlfriend or something? It's not like that. It's just, it hasn't even been six months since she entered the company, and yet she asks out her trainer. She's too obsessed with love. Hmm. But they say you can't stop falling in love, right? That's not all. I also don't like the way she shows off her home-cooked food every time. The company is not a place to find a marriage partner. If she's looking for a man, she should do it somewhere else. Don't be so hard. I was happy with Kazuki's cookies, though. And, well, Minase's arguments were relatively reasonable at first. But he gradually started to rag on Kazuki. I don't like how she has a lot of steamed vegetables in her tiny lunchbox. Well, there were a lot of steamed vegetables. But is that enough for you to dislike her? I prefer a massive lunch with a lot of meat. That's your preference. And I feel like she's the type to bake cupcakes on her day off. That's prejudice. Come on, it's nice and girly. And eventually... I don't know, she's like a fairy who stumbled into the human world. She probably sucks honey from flowers or something. I don't get it anymore. It's just a false accusation at this point. You're basically saying that you don't like girls who don't have flaws, right? No, well, let's just go with that. I was joking about how you should take a chance earlier. You should watch out for that girl, too. Even if she's not your type, you don't have to rag on her that much. Minase's a jerk. As I thought that and listened to his complaints, I noticed something about Kazuki. 
Yuma-san, here's some macarons if you like. I made too many again. Oh, thanks. They look so good. Now that I think about it, this girl only gives out sweets to guys. We have a lot of female employees, but I've never seen her give out to them. I mean, have I ever seen Kazuki talking to a female employee? On a different occasion... Oh, are you working overtime? You finished the work that I gave you on time, right? Yes, Kazuki-san asked me to do this and I couldn't refuse. Are you serious? I'll help you too. Let's work together and go home early. Kazuki made a younger, timid-looking girl work overtime without my knowledge, and in her spare time, she handed out homemade sweets to guys in the company, showing off her cooking skills. I found out later that Kazuki had a bad reputation among female employees since she first joined the company. The company is not a place to find a marriage partner. If she's looking for a man, she needs to do it somewhere else. If Minase hadn't told me, I might never have realized that Kazuki was that kind of girl. And a few years later, I was at a wedding hall. My colleague Minase got married. Minase got a girlfriend a little after Kazuki asked him out, and they successfully made it. Today's ceremony was attended by many of our colleagues from the company, and Minase was being celebrated with great enthusiasm. I knew you beat me to it, Minase! <laughs> Take good care of your wife, alright? Thank you for celebrating with us today. Yuma, you better get married soon, too. Minase and his wife, as well as the other attendees, were all smiling and filled with joy. But one person was there watching the scene with a complicated expression on her face. One day, a few days after Minase's wedding, I was working overtime when I heard an argument coming from the kitchen. I was curious, so I went to check on them. Why did you marry that woman, Minase-san? I'm prettier, can cook, and have a better figure than her. Please check it here and now! Hey, stop! Somebody help! What are you doing? Hey, Yuma, help me! She's trying to take her clothes off all of a sudden! No, Yuma-san! I was ordered by Minase-san, I had no choice! <laughs> huh? I didn't say that! Kazuki had been one-sidedly coming on to Minase until a while ago. When she found out that he had no interest, she started crying, playing the victim. Yeah, yeah, I heard everything. Even if you can't give up on Minase, there's no reason to make advances on a married man in your company, I said, and saved Minase. I'm glad it was me who noticed. If it had been any other guy, they would have believed Kazuki and Minase would have been arrested. After that, I was on my guard for a while, thinking Kazuki might try to mess with him again. However, she seemed to have given up on Minase once and for all, and never did anything after that. On the contrary, recently there have been rumors going around regarding Kazuki again. The truth is unknown, but it's said she started dating the department manager. He's a married man with two children. When I heard the reason you rejected her, I honestly thought something was wrong with you, but now I can see that you were correct. From the moment I saw her, I knew she was trouble, I just couldn't put it into words. It took me a while to understand what you were saying, because you're so bad at explaining things. I wonder what she's doing now. It's been two months since she was rumored to be in love with the manager. That's right. Kazuki is no longer in our company. Sometime after the rumors started about the relationship between Kazuki and the manager, it was discovered that it was not just a rumor, and they were actually having an affair within the company. The story naturally became a big topic of conversation at work. Kazuki became pregnant, and the manager who was using the company expenses for the affair couldn't bear the various responsibilities and disappeared. Kazuki was burned to the ground from the fees demanded by the manager's wife, and resigned while being watched from afar by her colleagues in the company. I'm glad I didn't try to go out with her, like you said. You saved my life too! If she turned your brain into a flower garden, I'd be in jail right now! Minase is a really great guy. By the way, what do you like about your wife? She makes me massive lunches with a lot of meat! I'm glad you're happy! Thanks for watching! Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. Bye!